I had a dream that you were mine. Hello, I'm not a stowaway. I'm doing a boat project. Let me show you what I'm doing. Like a balloon under the sea. I rose up from pressure beneath. Ah, every time. So gloriously, uncontrollably. All right. This is today's project. I don't like these little backing plates, so I'm taking them off. What I'm doing is I got this thick piece of wood and I waterproofed it. Yeah, I'm gonna put that big chunk of wood up there. That's a backing plate. Completely waterproofed. And then uh, when I do the interior paint, I will also paint through it. And I'll seal it up around the uh, holes because I don't want any flex in this. So, these are just leftover parts from a, another engine mount. But I want something bigger and better. So that's 12 inches by 12 inches and inch thick, waterproofed. I don't think I can do any better than that. That's my project for today. So I'm in probably the most cramped area in the boat. Maybe this is the aft cabin. That's what it is. It just needs a little fixing up. <laughs> I'm in the aft cabin of a Compact 23. But anyway, that's my project. And it should go pretty quick. I just need to unscrew those, pull it off, measure it, drill it, put it back on, seal it up also. But another job and uh, get me closer to the water. So see ya. just working on getting them perfectly centered so I'm just marking them out I just want anybody who ever looks at anything to know that somebody really cared who installed it and then we'll clean the transom a little bit and then we'll install it with a little silicone I think I'm still gonna use these aluminum pieces or not I'll just clean them up a little bit I always lay down a little carpet to catch all the um, sawdust and shavings. Well, let's see if it fits. Back in the hole. Tight spot. I did here. Really a two man job. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Pushing them out the back of the boat. Yeah, it's a little tough one push, let me tell you. Well, that's the finished job there. One problem is that we have a little bit of moisture in the uh, transom. And as I tighten it down, the little drips would come out, like you see right, right there. It's all about learning every square inch of your boat, you know? Well, I got the through hole installed. That's another job off my list. I also use penetrating epoxy to beef up the uh, outboard motor bracket pad. Let me show you. Things solid as a rock now. Look at that perfect fit. But the problem is, I'm not going to be able to get my fuel line out, so I'm going to turn this piece around.
Got my son Remington on the helm. We're in the bay. We made it. We're about to raise some sails. day out here. Boat feels nice. Got the main up and a tiny little head sail. Just trying stuff out. Click, click through, try to send this box to be a show, be fun. 